The forestry step test also gives a prediction of VO2 max. Participants will step up in time with a cadence of 90 beats per minute for five minutes. Males should use a bench at a height of 40 centimetres, whilst females should use a bench at a height of 33 centimetres. At the end of the five minutes, the participants should stop, find their pulse and count beats for 15 seconds. They then use the conversion table to find the prediction of VO2 max. Similarly to the multi-stage fitness test, I want you to find the conversion table for the forestry step test and compare your own data. So that summarises the multi-stage fitness test and forestry step tests that measure aerobic endurance. Make sure you remember why coaches and athletes would use these tests and what benefit they would have to the training programmes. Coaches need to know the starting point for an athlete's fitness in order to set targets or goals in their training. These tests are then regularly performed to see how the athlete is progressing towards these targets and to assess if the training programs have been successful.